What's up, Rube? It's Little Big Robots back with another video. This time I'm talking about Choo Choo's Demi Trainer. What's the song? I can't remember. Dun 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 dun. dun. Anyway, this is um, a new suit from the new um, show called um, Mercury. What is it called? The Witch from Mercury. I forget. Why am I forgetting that? I've been enjoying it a lot. You can watch this for free on... Well, for free. You can pay on uh, Crunchyroll, and you'll get to watch it as part of their service. Move the regular Demi Trade over here. Um, and then you can pay for their service and get... And you get... I, I think it has dubs on the earlier ones, like English dubs. But it definitely has uh, good subtitles if that's your preferred method for watching. Um, I don't really care myself either way. I watch it in both ways. Let me show you what you get in the box. Hope everybody's doing all right while I'm getting this out here. Hope everybody's doing a good weekend and all that stuff I got. All right, my setup lately has been really strange. I'm always messing with my recording setup here. But anyway, so Choo Choo is in this series. And she's this interesting pilot with a giant pair of pink hair buns. She's super violent. There is a little bit of a meme going around, or kind of like a little gif you'll, you might see where she just punches the living hell out of this girl who's making fun of somebody. I think it might have been, might have been making fun of Choo Choo, and she literally just knocks her. It looks like she kills the girl. She's just, it's such a great shot, such a great shot. So this is a Demi Trainer. A Demi Trainer in the series is basically, to give the setup real quick, they live in a giant, uh, kind of a classic ring um, station planet, you know what I'm saying? Like the one they crashed into the Earth as part of the Xeon War, whatever the heck it was. So they and and it's basically a school. And this is the Demi Trainer. So this is the common grunt suit they use, and they train to fight. And you know, boom, 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 they go in right there. This is a fun little kit, but at the same time, super frustrating, and I can't figure it out why the the legs were getting so loose. I think I might have figured it out now. There, there was some issue with the legs coming apart up top. You, you can see where I was beating it up because I just couldn't figure out why these were so loose. <laughs> Excuse me. Like I said, I think I have it now. This has an issue, you know. So this is definitely a great, a fantastic grunt suit. If you pick up three or four of these, that's going to be a wise idea because you know how hard, hard it is to find certain grunts now. <laughs> so this is Choo Choo's Demi Trainer where she basically took, they took the same one. And they outfitted it with better stuff, made it much more fast and cool um, for hit and run tactics. They they say I love this style of head. That is my favorite. Let me show you here. So you have your classic classic bot like this guy, right? With the humanoid style head, right? So I've reviewed this guy. If you look back on my videos about a few weeks, you'll see him. This is one of my favorite kits of all time they're like 13 bucks 10 to 13 bucks and it has this what looks like a head but it's actually a little like a scout thing drone it, when the, the head goes in here it has this lovely very simple i love this type of thing this is something like i said last time you could see they drop it off surrounded by a balloon on mars it pops up and they're like little worker bees i love these little guys i love them love them love them. i bought several of them <laughs> excuse me this head reminds me that it's just it doesn't look up and down it has this kind of a thing i believe it will actually tilt up in the cartoon and stuff it has this interesting thing too where it, it comes up like that i'm not sure why this part does this i can't remember in the anime if it shows it but either way it's a it's a great physical part i like that a lot um, the design is definitely improved I, i'm finding that the legs and the feet are are bit are more improved over the original demi trainer um, but I still have an issue with these kind of feet where if you see they have a rounded back and this silly, this is what, uh, whatchamacallit, Iron-Blooded Orphans use. I don't know if I have one of their kits here built in front of me, but Iron-Blooded Orphans feet basically had a foot that is on a ball joint, which is great. You can do all this cool posing stuff, right? But as you can see, it does this. So it's very easy to, you try to stand it up and you get it like that, but it's rocking back on its heels. And now, of course, it's standing as I see it. So the Demi, Demi, Tra <sighs> Demi Trader has the same thing, but it has these cool looking back feet, but it doesn't matter because it's going to rock on, it, on its heels still. It just makes it really frustrating sometimes 
to, to stand up. It reminds me a bit of these feet from another one of my favorite. This is the guard frame. And it it's just a single foot with a little part on it with that. That's all you need in a kit of this price range and this size. You don't need a split foot. So I can stand him. You know, it, it's so much easier. You don't have to worry about it because you don't have this separate part that can simply split. It can go like that or it, more often it's going to go like that because as you're setting up, you're pushing down on that front lip there and then, it, and then it's unbalanced and you got this rocking thing, right? But other than that, excuse me, allergies. So let's move these guys out of the way. So it's definitely an improvement over this guy. I'm going to build another one of these. I have a few of them to see if maybe I... Because sometimes, you know, I might be drinking a little bit or hanging out and not paying attention and I might build it a little wrong. And so it looks a little... It, it, that explains its weirdnesses. But this guy I paid attention and it's definitely a much more stout kit. But you still have the same kind of uh, weirdness here with that ball joint for the shoulder. So you got to be aware of that. But overall, it feels like it does have a much... Um, a much better quality um, build here. That's why I think it's a little bit more. That that's a grunt suit. This is like a grunt suit plus. So it, she's not like a gun to pilot, but it's just I love grunt suits. They're my favorite. I love simple designs for stuff like that. The hand doesn't need to twist as much as the whole hand can twist. The whole wrist can twist. I love these three fingered hands. It's just real primitive. That's all you need. You know, these little shield things are cool. They kind of go up and down, which I thought was kind of interesting. Let me see which way do they go. Let's see if I can. Woo! Oh, jeez. Let me get that real quick. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Okay, so see that little slot there? That little. So it's already all the way down. So you should be able to slide it like that. So you can adjust it. I don't know if they're. I can't remember if those are like thrusters. Yeah, I think they're like thrusters that adjust. You know, it's just a neat little gimmick. There you go. Uh, the knee parts move like that. So you've got. Oh, it's a little bit spread apart there so it's got some neat little things to play with and to give it different looks again minus the feet i just hate the feet that loose um it's a just such a such a fun little kit this would have made the better grunt i think of course it's just a better quality it's better looking but when they make grunts they really want them to look really oh god damn it they make them want to look really plain like these guys to where they don't ha they don't outshine the 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 ball you know the the main character's suit at all and choo choo prominent is prominent in the show so much that you know they really had to add all this um the backpack's fine i personally would rather not have it the, it's just the bulk of it it's just back heavy why i know she's gonna fly and stuff this was an interesting thing i noticed in the in the uh, demi trainer is it's got this weird gimmick where you do this and you can move the is that to simulate a crunch i guess because they do show this position a lot they love showing that, and I think that that's has to be have that crunch in order to do that kind of flying back position. I at the same time, I don't. It, it just seems like such a waste of a gimmick there to just give her a crunch when you could have just given her a. Cr I, I don't know. I don't know what that what's happening. Oh, seeing that just fell off. So see, see, look, the rear skirt's gone, and now she's automatically got a crunch. So why why put just put the skirt. Just give her a crunch and put the skirt on. I, I don't know. It's just a weird. I must be missing something there. But that does give you some more, some more uh, flexibility for like different positions and stuff. Really, really fun kit. Um, I again, just kind of sh comparing it to let's say these amazing guys that I reviewed as well. If you want to check out those, you know, not as many details on the surface, but could definitely stand up in the same universe. Really, really cool. These are one forty four. One and 144 scale, these are 160 scale. But if I take out the look at the pilot here, see the pilot in there? So you could you could totally see that being the same universe, huh? So I love comparing to different sizes like that. I think it's just a great, but overall, blends in perfectly. This is what I'm going for. I'm going for a collection of different bots that will, you know, look good on the shelf and just a big bot and fun mess for photography and stuff and th these definitely s serve that purpose so yeah go pick up the choo-choo uh, if you're gonna pick up a grunt and you need grunts like i do i collect all grunts grab you a regular demi trainer but if you're gonna grab several i'd rather have hers so look for a sale grab three or four of these leave one in a box and build you a little mini army of them because this is a fun little kit so anyway have a good one everybody i'll talk to you later Bye bye